Behind us is the new Wilmar 26 tonne loco. It's the first new locomotive in our fleet for the last 25 years. So from concept development in mid 2020, um, 2021 was our detailed design phase. So we did all the detailed engineering to um, redesign the chassis, all the gearboxes and the bogies. And we started um, building the machine in 2021 and it's been about a 12 month build time to get to where we are now. This locomotive looks like a Baldwin, but it's not a Baldwin. When we went into the design phase um, for this project, we started at a concept level with the original Baldwin drawings and design, and then we've engineered it from the ground up to meet our new requirements. We've made a lot of improvements through the design process, um, in particular with the gearbox design. We've redesigned the gearboxes to meet our um, service and duty requirements. The gearboxes are now able to be used in a 32 ton machine, but also able to fit down into a 26 ton machine and they'll meet the service life requirements um, for all of our track um, and operation requirements. The other big improvement is the elimination of vibration. So we've um, soft mounted the engine, which is the first machine of this size to have that. And that's significantly reduced the chassis vibration and all the vibration through the exhaust system and on all the electronics. So we're expecting less um, maintenance costs and um, longer asset life. Another big improvement is around our control system. So a few years ago, we uh, found an issue where our um, remote shunting units, our RSU units um, have become obsolete and we needed to move to a new technology. Uh, as a result of that, we took the opportunity to bring our new control system up to a fit for purpose system, which is utilizing CAN bus technology. So we've redesigned the entire control system um, using that new architecture and we've selected a new RSU unit that's um, fit for purpose. So moving forward, this control system will also be used in our 40 tonne locos as well as our 26 to 32 tonne locos. So it'll be our new standard control system and RSU system moving forward whenever we do a new um, locomotive upgrade. This project um, has taken about two and a half years from concept through to delivery. The project cost is around two and a half million, so two million for the locomotive and half a million for the brake wagon. It has involved a very significant portion of the business to execute um, from all different areas. So from asset management through to operations and execution, it's been a whole of business effort to get to where we are. From an engineering perspective, this has been a really great opportunity. I've really enjoyed the process from concept all the way through to delivery. Uh, it's an engineer's dream to have a blank slate to start with. Uh, for me, it's, it's been the highlight of my career so far, and I look forward to implementing these machines in the future.